It's an easy and fun way to learn a piece of the past. So you just press the button and you get a piece of history. You press the button and they come to life and tell you all about their person. I am the highest earning woman athlete of all times. I am Serena Wynn. These young students at Revelation Christian Academy have found a unique and engaging way to teach us about black history and the struggle for equality with a wax museum of figures who come to life. I am Angela Banks. I am John Lewis. I am Anthony Ray I am Lexi Hughes. And I am impressed, and I'm not alone. Now, imagine getting your history lesson from someone who is portraying that character, and then imagine getting that history lesson from someone portraying you. Local state representative Barbara Drummond is about to meet Barbara Drummond. It must be a treat to meet you. <laughs> was it a treat to meet me? Why was it a treat? I was shocked. But the real Barbara was delighted. Uh, because for us to continue a community that is one filled with equality and prosperity for all, we need people like Chloe. So I'm honored uh, to have Chloe Williams as the Barbara Drummond this morning. Local attorney Carlos Finley had the joy of meeting his late mother and Mobile Black History preservationist Dora Finley. Well, it almost brought tears to my eyes. I think it did. <laughs> <laughs> Anthony Ray Hinton made history when he spent 30 years on Alabama's death row as an innocent man, free today and touched by this young man's effort to betray him. You know, I'm just so proud that uh, they invited me to come and be a part of it. He has a lesson to give in return. And I wanted to prove to these very young people that regardless of what society say you are, what society think you are, you go out there and you prove them wrong. It's often said that history repeats itself, and that's not always a good thing. But today at Revelation Christian Academy in Mobile, it was a very good thing. Darwin Singleton, NBC 15 News.